Yo, 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 you too. What to do? Hydric69, aka your monster mobile boy, back with another video. Today, I'm going to be giving some tips on how to get accepted faster in the GeForce Now beta for Fortnite Mobile. Like the clip you're seeing now, I'll be throwing up clips from my boy Ken. Big shout outs to him. Here's his channel, guys. Go show him love and subscribe. He's probably one of the best players who's playing right now on the beta version. Now, before I get into my tips, I do want to say these are kind of like speculation. There hasn't been a proven method to get an invite from NVIDIA, but based on what they've posted so far and what I've seen in your comments, I think there will be some ways to maybe get accepted sooner. Now, first tip we got to talk about is what device you're actually playing on. I have not seen many Android players playing on the beta version compared to the amount of Apple players I've seen. I think you have a better chance when you sign up to say you're playing on an Apple device. As far as I know, once you have access to the beta, you can play it on whatever device you want it on. This would further make sense because they'd want it on more Apple devices than Android just because Apple devices would run the beta smoother and they'd get better reviews for their game. Next up, we gotta talk about whether you need to buy the paid version of GeForce Now or you should just continue with the free version. In my opinion, it would make sense for NVIDIA to give out the beta to members who actually pay for it because then they're actually getting use of their membership. If you have gotten the beta of Fortnite Mobile, let me know in the comments if you pay for a GeForce Now membership or if you have the free one. And since we're about the middle of the video, make sure you guys drop a like if this helps you out and subscribe to the channel to stay updated on everything that happens with GeForce Now and Fortnite Mobile. Now you might be wondering after you join the waitlist what should be your next step and GeForce did actually say to try and play other games on GeForce Now. The reason you'd want to go check out other games on GeForce Now and see what it's about trying to play different games is because they may track activity on your actual account and they'd want to give accounts that already use and play GeForce Now the beta. If they see people are already using their GeForce Now account, they're going to want to give those people the access to the beta because they can rely on them to actually give them feedback and play the GeForce Now beta. I would also highly recommend you add your home screen shortcut to GeForce Now on your actual device as maybe this won't help you get the beta faster but once you do get the beta this will allow you to play a lot quicker cutting down the steps you need to take to actually play the game. And because there isn't a set time for how long the beta will last and go on for, I would make sure you guys do this as soon as possible because you really don't want to waste any time and we all want to increase our chances of being able to play the beta. Share your tips on how to get the beta version if you think you have any ideas on how to increase your chances because I know everybody in the comments and watching is looking to play as soon as possible, including myself. Like I said, make sure to drop a like and subscribe so you don't miss out on anything going on with Fortnite Mobile. Thank you guys for watching. Thank you for the support. I'll keep you updated. Peace.